The Chinese company Sinovac Biotech is conducting one of four clinical trials authorized in China. It says it has had promising results in tests on macaque monkeys. Human trials have just begun and thousands of shots of the vaccine have been produced. Though the drug has a long way to go before it is approved. Currently we are constructing uh, new facilities mm -hmm. uh, in Changping province of Beijing. Mm -hmm. And our target production capacity is uh, 100 million dose per year. In the United States, one drug produced by the pharmaceutical company Gilead Sciences could possibly help. After disappointing data in one trial, early results from another on its drug, Remdesivir, showed it cut recovery time for patients from 15 to 11 days. The data shows that Remdesivir has a clear-cut significant positive effect. The mortality rate trended towards being better in the sense of less deaths in the Remdesivir group. 8% versus 11% in the placebo group. One study in France, meanwhile, has shown that an arthritis drug, tozilizumab, has shown early promise in preventing extreme inflammation in seriously ill COVID-19 patients. Le tozilizumab est un médicament euh, qu'on appelle une thérapie ciblée, c'est-à-dire qui va agir à un endroit très précis dans l'organisme en ciblant une petite molécule de communication entre les cellules de l'inflammation. And in the UK, the pharmaceutical company AstraZeneca says it will know by June or July whether a vaccine it's working on with the University of Oxford will be effective or not.